but whatever this justice is that you get this generous blessing you get from the justice system is putting you into this king of pentacles energy whether you're masculine or feminine drugs are involved like they're these people are like selling drugs and stuff as well oh i said that already and i'm drunk it's something about children man i'm telling you right now something about children and something with blood um they're like i don't know if they're like doing like blood sacrifices or like um they're do, like something to do like they're injecting children's blood They put fear into these kids or something like that. So I'm just seeing in my third eye, I'm seeing like a, like a, like a kid being scared, like, like scared like the boogeyman or something like that. And then I'm just seeing somebody with a syringe, like pulling blood. Pulling blood unless it's like a, just like maybe like a psychic vampire or something. They're doing something with children and I'm hearing it, the, the drainage rooms, whatever it's called. But when you get this justice, okay, it's going to be like taking the weight of the world off your shoulders and you're having the palm, the, the, the world in the palm of your hand. You know, you could be a seer, a visionary. You're being told to visualize your home to whatever you want, like, you know, visualize. Holy Spirit, and also your ex was paid to come in to watch you, stalk you, to get close to you, and he was your hitman. But, like, he was unable to because you're too protected, and you cut him off at the right time. They made multiple attempts to unalive you. Poisoned you. Drugged you. Yeah, they were very sloppy, though. They didn't realize. They left, like, a major, like, trail. They thought they were untouchable, that's why. But they didn't realize they were being watched. I'm sure only getting whatever you do. I feel like you're a very hard worker, okay? You always have been your whole life, all right? And, like, when you get this justice, it's going to help you, like, relax a little bit where you don't have to work as much, okay, because you deserve it. But also, these people were really sloppy. Also, they went to somebody to, I don't know if they went to go pay for a hitman because you cut these people off. They ended up getting a police officer. It was secretly a cop. I don't know if they went on the dark web or whatever this is. But they left a lot of, like, they, there was a lot of, um, some about Bitcoin or something like that could be significant. There, could, there are some sort of investments that was left to you or something. But they left some sort of digital trail, paper trail. Somebody's also writing a statement, like, on these people. There's people, like... They, they went and got, they messed around. They were, they were very sloppy. And maybe it was your ex or, or somebody from your past or just all these people. They left a lot of evidence behind. Somebody, there's money hidden in the house. Maybe possibly under the floorboards. Strong and getting under the floorboards. There's something about a trap door. Or it could even be inside the in the walls or something like that. Could be a Leo. But the justice system also sees your strength, your power. They are completely amazed with you. Like they can't believe like how and they sent you some sort of attack like they sent some sort of a demonic entity to you and you tamed the beast they're like what the freak are you kidding me and that same beast that you tamed that same demonic entity that they sent your way you tamed it and it went back and it started attacking them you could be a leo or this could be about a leo I strongly feel like there's a Leo 
that's secretly working with the authorities. This person was once against you, but now they're working for you. They're trying to attack. Yeah, they're trying to attack you. They can't get into your energy. Okay, look at this. There's like a, a force field around you. There's like a, there's a scratch in here, right? I don't know if y'all can see it. There's a line and it looks like an arrow. There's like, they're trying to get into your energy. They're trying to break down your strength or your power as well. And they can't get in. It looks like a line. I don't know. Like, where's that? There's like a line here and there's like an arrow pointing to it. Somebody's name could begin with a Z. I also see a Z right there. It's her name is Zach. Maybe you seen that Or Zoe. Somebody about a K. Somebody in the, with initial K, first, middle, or last. A C or a C, K, possibly. And yeah, look, and now I'm looking at this, okay? There's a line here, and then there's an arrow pointing to it, and then there's a line going this way. It looks like an arrow. What they sent to you, whatever the same demon that you tamed, is they sent it to you, and it went right back to them. And they can't get into your, you're too powerful, you're too strong, you're too powerful, and you're too protected. They can't get into your energy. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, all ones passed away. What does the collective need to know? Everything I just said is the Ace of Swords truth, and the one million percent Ace of Swords truth has come out about these people. about everything you're extremely powerful bro extremely they're under heavy judgment because of this heavy judgment the feds know everything or the authorities the justice knows everything about this father figure this uncle figure this masculine energy with a child um for some of you it's also a baby dad here um and this workplace has stole from you your ex everything they know about all their plots and plans, everything. And they're under heavy judgment for what they've done to you. Archangel Michael has his th his foot on their throats and getting ready to stick this, this sword, his sword right into their jugular. They're also doing some sort of freezer spells on you. They had to let you out of the freezer because they realized that it did the opposite effect. They, they tried to freeze you and your finances. But they had to look, this looks like freezers, right? It reminds me of like a little, like one of big freezers, but they're being open, they're being let out, could possibly be, like they could even have like quite a few people. Oh, shipping containers. You're freeing a lot of souls, you freed your ancestors, I just heard, as well. They're shipping people, maybe even children. There's a lot of shady stuff going on here. Judgment's been called on them, or maybe you needed to call a judgment, or you did. I strongly feel like you're a spiritual, um, you're a spiritual judge. You have the authority to call a judgment, and I feel like you did. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, look, there's something about, something about the water. You might want to cleanse, because I feel like they were attacking your, um, your crown chakra as well. You might want to cleanse if you have Palo Santo stick, sage, um, whatever you know. What I mean, whatever you do to cleanse, you might want to do that. Okay. Yeah, somebody's getting kicked out of the justice system as well for abusing their power. Okay, and I feel like this is that person that the authorities that were working with them they got caught up and they got kicked out. Somebody's getting kicked out. They're like also this workplace that fired you or this, 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 um, it was an illegal fireman. Okay. They did this and they stole from you. And also like that landlord I was telling about before, I was telling you all about before somebody's getting fired or got fired. Somebody that you have you sort of against. Yeah. They, they kicked you out and stole your property and stuff. They illegally kicked you out. You're getting your justice for that. Some, they're, somebody's getting kicked out of this group. Well, maybe your ex, okay? Like I said, like this group called Coven's like secretly celebrating your, your foundation. Maybe they kicked your ex out of the... Um, maybe they... I feel like they, they kicked your ex out of this group called Coven's Secret Society or they're about to um, because they found out your ex was working with the justice system. 
And again, as I'm saying, somebody wants to get you a house because they, you moved out of this house or they kicked you out of this house, whatever it was, and there was cameras in that house. And this is why they want to give you, and it's because, you know, they want to watch you. They made a lot of money off of you. A lot of money. This business, that business, that, that, that old workplace is getting shut down. There's a lot going on here. Yeah, you're very powerful, homie. And somebody in power is losing, you know, I mean, a judge, I feel like, is losing her job as well. Because they they had a judge in this group called Club and Secret Society. Somebody got caught up for unaliving somebody. You're getting good luck and fortune, okay? Your ships are coming in. They know this. They're, these people are getting bad karma. You're going to have a reason to celebrate. They're watching you, seeing you get this... Um, you know, getting this good luck and fortune, you know, you have many opportunities coming your way and they're getting bad karma for all the illusions that they cast. They, they were very sloppy, whatever they did. They left a lot of evidence behind. They wanted you in your head. They were sending you some sort of psychic attacks. That's not happening. All right. Return to sender. And the truth about how they were trying to make you mentally unstable on all everything that they're doing to you. All right. And would, so they could steal from you. Yeah, they wanted you in your head about, like, they didn't want you to realize who you were. They're trying to get, they're attacking you, trying to get you to not realize who you are, not realize that you are this, this star. You are heavily protected from these psychic attacks and everything else. All right, there's a, there's a, um, there's a hidden, like I said, you don't know about this, but you have a hidden protection order, all right? And your good luck and fortune is protected, all right? You're protected from this death magic they were doing too. They they were very sloppy. They left some sort of evidence. Look at the body right there. They left some sort of evidence behind. Down by the um the river, down by the seas where my baby done left me. They could have left somebody and look, there's like a river or a sea, there's like a body of water right there. And there's a person laying right there, right down by the river, down by the sea. That's where my baby done left me. But it's been illuminated. You're also about to have some sort of rebirth. That's going to help you. You know what I mean? Um, help you not have to work so hard, okay? You know? Yeah. There's somebody in power in the justice system. They see your strength and your power as well. They're being watched, okay? They're protecting you. They're watching. They're, you know, you're protected. They're, there's a protection order here, okay? These people are going to prison for unaliving somebody and attempting to unalive you. It's a painful permanent ending and somebody's going to prison because they literally unalive somebody, without a doubt. And I feel like there was multiple people. They could have unalived seven people. These people from your past, this group called Club and Secret Society, maybe even more. They were trying to do some sort of binding magic to you too, to unalive you. There are plots and plans to have you, um, they want you kidnapped, possibly R word, beat up, and, you know. There's something about a hidden death as well. We have 8-8, eight, eight. they're going to prison for this, and you're getting abundance of prosperity. What they invest in, they invest in trying to unalive you, and they actually unalive people. This workplace too, um, they're going to prison too because they all uh, for for that as well. They they were part of plotting and planning to unalive you. They made attempts too. I feel like you were poisoned or drugged at work. It was attempt to unalive you, but you were too strong, too powerful. Okay. Whatever seeds you're planting are, are flourishing beautifully. You're about to be into this Queen of Pentacles energy if you're not already. They're trying so hard to end this. They're going to prison and you're rapidly progressing. Okay, whatever you're investing in, you're about to have some sort of like major rapid pro um, progression. Okay, it's about to speed up. Okay, 
all right because yeah whatever you're doing for your work too you're doing you're such a loving nurturing caring person okay there's a queen of cups in the reverse going to prison for or maybe she passed away this could be i'm strong against this that somebody's passing away i feel like it's that woman's going to be passed away from her heart or maybe she did maybe you don't know about this there's somebody hidden death that you don't know about they're under judgment heavy judgment because you're in your purpose you know, you took a sleep of faith, you're in your purpose, you're doing what God sent you here to do. And because of that, you, everything is coming and they're attacking your work. They're like, you know what I mean? They were attacking your um, your purpose. You're here doing God's work, what God sent you here to do. So they're not attacking you, they're attacking God, not smart. They feel left out, they're losing out on opportunities, or they're all sulking because, um, you know what I mean? You know, they, they, they're all sulking because they realize you were their blessing from God. And they, you know, they know that you are an earth angel and they're, they're stupid. You have somebody coming in to protect you. And look, I'm going to leave right here, guys. Yeah. From whatever their plans were to come up against you. And look, you're going to somehow turn everything you've been through. You're just like, you know, you're just been using these people. as like, you know what I mean? Whatever they've been do doing to you, you're building this bridge, okay? You like your whole bridge and everything was crumbled down because it was like pe the, all these people were fake and phony around you. They were all plotting and planning against you. Now you're building your bridge over them. You shut the fuck up, bitch. You um, you're pl you're you're building your own bridge. You're creating your own bridge. The wall, you know, um, your own castle. Okay, your your own empire, and nobody, none of these people can come with you. They're all plotting. They're all going to prison. Okay, everybody involved in this situation, even people. All right, say. There's people that knew about what was going on to you and they just sat back and they watched it happen and they didn't do anything about it. They're going, they're in trouble too. They're accessory. And they're getting conspiracy, you know what I mean? They didn't do anything about it. They sat back and watched a earth angel getting tortured. So they better speak up because if they don't speak up, they're going to be they're going to be going to prison too. And this is like a RICO act without a doubt because there's so many people involved. There's a whole group called Covenant Secret Society of people. So and the Fed's been watching these people for a long time. So all the times that they were talking to these people around like about whatever's going on, they know that these people knew about it and they did nothing about it. They could have stopped it. But they didn't. So they need to speak about it. Okay, now I'm thinking about yesterday when I had the, the throat chakra and um, uh, meditation on in the background, med, uh, frequency on in the background. I was saying somebody needs to speak up or something. Yeah, and it's the spirit of letting you know somebody that watches my channel, they didn't do anything to you, but they sat back and watched it happen. And they know. Well, guess what? The feds were watching you as well because they, when the feds are investigating they investigate you and everybody you know everybody that you you are around so these people you were being recorded and they know that you knew about this so you need to speak up so that you don't get in trouble because you're you're going to get conspiracy you're going to get um you know what i mean you're an accessory to all these crimes and the rico act that's 30 years in prison And that's like, and whatever these people are involved in, unaliving people and attempting unalive, but there's actually first degree here as well. And when, with the RICO Act, when one person gets charged, they all get charged for it. So that then, and the RICO itself is 30 years plus um, attempted unalivement and first degree. And I heard even second and third degree as well. So unless you want to go to prison for the rest of your life and get these charges that everybody else is getting, and I'm telling you, there's something to do with children as well. Crazy stuff happening with children as well. You need to speak about this because the authorities know that you know. So you need to speak about this or else you're going to get charged too and you don't want to get charged. And I know it's been eating at your conscience. Like, and it's because that spirit's way of trying to like nudge you like, yo, do something, do something. Because it's because God doesn't want to see you go down, but you will fall. You will fall if you don't say something. So you need to speak. Speak now or forever hold your peace. And you're going to go down with them.
so I don't want to see it happen to you. God doesn't want to see it happen to you. The authorities already know you're not telling or you're not snitching. Like everybody, they're already caught. This is just why you're gonna let yourself go down, okay? Don't do that. Because these people would throw you under a bus in a heartbeat. They would frame you. Because I guarantee you they're gonna say that you were involved to try to get less charges. And you weren't, so you need to speak about it and you need to do it now. All right. Don't get caught up in something that you don't realize how deep this really goes. Like, do you really want to go to prison, like, for especially these charges when it has to do with children? Because you're about to. These people wouldn't do anything for you. They're going to throw you under the bus and lie on you and see that you were involved so that they get less time. And I really feel like you have no involvement in this, but you knew about it. And the authorities were there recording you when with you, they know you were there, like, you know, how they were talking about it, they know you know. So speak up now or forever hold your peace and go to prison with these losers and have really have a target on your back because you're gonna get charged with some crazy charges. All right. And I feel like you're worried about thinking that the collective's gonna be mad at you because you knew, no, the collective's gonna be happy with you because you finally said something. They're, how do you think the collective's gonna feel when they find out that you knew and you did nothing about it? So go get your merit making and save your own ass before you get caught up. Because the cops know everything. And I feel like this is coming down like it's starting, they're starting to fall. It's happening. And if you wait to say something, you know, these people are already speaking. They're already telling on each other. And the authorities already know everything. So you need to, you know what I mean? I'm telling you right now, you need to say something before something said to you. Before you, before your door gets kicked in. Because that's what's about to happen. I don't know, y'all. I'm going to leave right here. Till next time, remember, God loves you, so do I spread love, not hate, always. And please do not forget to give God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, loved ones that passed away. The utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation for all that they do in our lives. Because they're moving mountains for us and getting ready to rain down miracles on us, right? Um, and please, if you did not hit that like button yet, please hit the like button. Please hit share. If you'd like to share it, and please hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And also, you want to be subscribed, okay, because I do giveaways every month, but it's for subscribers only, so make sure you're subscribed, okay? Um, and I do double check and make sure, okay? I, do I definitely double check. Um, but yeah. Alright. And if you like to donate, you do not have to. It's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of, but with all of my heart, I had time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so, and to everybody who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And for the memberships and super thanks and everything. Thank you, guys. May God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. All right, God bless.